All right, so I downloaded the Project Naptha browser extension today. I believe it's pronounced Project Naptha. Um, also, I'm not too sure if it's on any browser other than Google Chrome. Uh, but nevertheless, <clears throat> I downloaded it and it wasn't very intuitive for me. Um, of course, I don't really too much read uh, instructions. I just like to sort of dive in and play with it, but it wasn't very intuitive. So I figured maybe there might be other people out there uh, sort of fumbling around trying to figure out how to get it to actually edit the text of a photo. Uh, and that's pretty much what it does. The browser doesn't really pop up uh, at the top right of Chrome. I'm sorry, the, the extension doesn't really pop up like my other extensions. It's really just built in to uh, the browser. And um, so I'll just show you what I figured out. So I did a Google search here, just typed in you know something random to find images. And uh, the first thing I noticed is that um, you cannot edit text um, from the uh, search query results page. So I'll show you what I mean by that. Uh, so again, the extension is built into the uh, browser. So what you'll do is really simply just sort of select and highlight whatever text it is that you want to uh, uh, edit but it does not work from this view so I'll just show you really quickly if I try to highlight and select it just sort of picks up the image you, you can't do anything so if you click on it go to the actual website that the image is on then you'll be able to select you just put your mouse over it and uh, left click over all the text you want and then you right click which is where the NAPTA extension uh, shows its menu options and uh, you got a few here you can copy the text which sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't I'll just try to do that really quickly so copy text and uh, there you go your best friend is dead and it but it if you can make it out on your screen here the s on two of the words are dollar signs so I don't know go figure but anyway, uh, so that's copy text. You can select all of the text, and it'll, you know, take do all of it. Um, pick your language and translate. I was surprised to find the erase text option under here. That again, something else that wasn't very intuitive. Uh, so let's give it a shot, and the text is literally gone. I mean unbelievably amazing <laughs> I've never seen anything like this it tries to uh, mask out um, a little bit of the image by you know um, sort of blending it into the existing background not perfect but it does the trick I'll show you an example on another photo here same thing uh, like the Google search um, you sort of have to well I guess it's letting me do it here uh, let's see okay so let's see and erase text and there it is uh, oh, come on erase text so pretty cool um, not too bad at all uh, let's see how it does on something like this yeah it's not letting me hear so some text it will do it others it won't I haven't figured out rhyme and reason as to how it uh, picks and chooses which text it wants to do but nevertheless um, it also will not work on Instagram um, I've tried 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 it will not work now I even tried to go directly to the page and do it here but it will not work. So that's it. Um, again, the Project Naptha um, web extension, browser extension. Um, you can either go directly through the uh, extension store under Google Chrome or to projectnaptha.com.